Prince Harry used to love terrorizing garden staff at Kensington Palace as a toddler. Prince Harry and his brother William used to love terrorizing garden staff at Kensington Palace, a royal estate manager jokingly recalled. Prince Charles and Diana moved to Kensington Palace in 1981 after their wedding, where they brought up the two sons. Graham Dillamore opened up on some of the mischievous antics the two princes got up to as toddlers, during Channel 5's documentary Kensington Palace, Behind Closed Doors. The two boys were here, very little at that time, they would come out and terrorize us in the garden or throw stones in the pond, he joked. Mr. Dillamore also met Princess Diana on numerous occasions in the grounds of Kensington Palace. She always popped by, she would sometimes be on her jog, he said. She tried rollerblading once but it didn't work too well. The royal estate manager described the occasion as a very special moment and said it was fantastic that they chose the sunken garden as the location. And here he was, a great young man with a beautiful bride-to-be, announcing his engagement, he said. You know, kids grow up, even royal kids. Prince William and Harry will unveil a commemorative statue to their mother on July 1st in the Sunken Garden. The date marks what would have been Diana's 60th birthday. She tragically died in a car accident in Paris on August 31, 1997. The two brothers commissioned the sculptor Ian Rank Broadley to make the statue in 2017, as they sought to celebrate her legacy. The Duke of Sussex is expected to fly back from the US in order to attend the unveiling. It will be the first time the two brothers come face to face since the funeral of the grandfather, Prince Philip, in April. 